Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome to the highly anticipated top 10 retail polls of the month for the month of Mayhem. The reason I say this is because it took a poll of $1,500 to get on the top 10 list for this month. And yes, these are all from retail boxes, which is insane. You just gotta see it to believe it, which we will get into in a second. But before we get into it, our sponsor PSA just announced their June grading specials today, if you're watching this on June 1st anyway. And these include a two week extension of their popular May 10X special. This is the perfect special for modern sports cards that are sent in bulk at just $16 per card. They are also offering a 20% discount on both of the Express Grading Special and the Super Express Grading Special. These are two of their higher service tiers, which are great for quick turnarounds on major hits such as the cards you see pulled on this show each week. And last, for you Pokemon collectors out there, they have a Pokemon bulk special returning this month at just $14 per card with a 15 card minimum per order. For more information on these specials, such as the declared values or the turnaround times, be sure to visit psacard.com specials. I will have a link down in my description box below, but you will need to be a collector's club member in order to access most of their grading specials. And they have two options for you they have the standard tier and the premium tier which the premium tier will give you about $65 more in break credit as well as a 12-month membership to card ladder pro now with a clip level of $1,500 you know there were many big cards pulled this month so we're going to show you five honorable mentions but even so there are many huge cards that didn't quite make this list and for that I sincerely apologize but if any of you out there pulled a big retail card even if it wasn't filmed be sure to drop a comment down below letting us know. But now it is time to get into those honorable mentions and make our way into the top 10 retail polls of the month. Our first honorable mention comes from Good Rips, who breaks over on whatnot, and this lucky dog had optic blasters for days. But look what he pulled out of the third one. Here we go, Shaq Thompson. Oh my goodness, we hit a downtown. Just when they were asking the details of where the boxes came from. We've done it. Oh my goodness, it's a rookie. Holy shnikes. What do y'all think? No sweat. Oh my goodness, Bryce Young on the downtown. Holy moly. And a Levis on the back. Holy sheesh. This is loaded. That is sick as all. Oh, get out, let's leave it. This is the Bryce Young Rookie Optic Downtown, and I have this at $750, which is what the last one of these sold for, and in the middle of the last three sales. I swear you guys make pulling one of these look so easy, but I am 0 for 100 on Optic Retail in my career, but maybe I'm just getting them from the wrong place. You guys let me know. Our next honorable mention comes from Colfax Collectibles, who break here on YouTube, and they were opening 2023 Donner's Optic Football. This was also a blaster box. The Dolphins are popping off right now, Jeremy. Huh? Oh my Ooh, goodness! Go. That's a that's a sparkle too. Look at that! That baby is a CJ sparkle. Stroud sparkle. That is a big boy. This is the CJ Stroud Rookie Blue Glitter, and I have this at $900, which is what the last one of these sold for, and in the middle of the last three sales as well. There is still no checklist release for Optic, which is crazy, but this was an ultra rare parallel first released last year, and they are insanely tough to pull. Our third honorable mention comes from Tough Break Cards, who break here on YouTube, and they were opening 2023-24 Select Basketball, and this was from a Mega Box. Bang, dude, let's go. Let's go. 
This is the Victor Wembenyama Courtside Purple Cracked Ice, numbered 86 out of 99, and I have this at $1,000 based on the last Raw sale, and the last PSA 10 went for $1,725. I know this poll came late at night, so well done not waking up the family. That takes incredible self-control, but did you have to open this right on top of your washing machine? I'm just kidding. Good Rips, who were just featured with the Bryce Young downtown, also pulled one of these on video this month which is crazy our fourth honorable mention comes from phoenix breaks who break here on youtube and they were opening 2023 donruss optic football and this was a blaster box got one. Oh, oh my god oh my god i know i saw it too dave i saw it too oh, always go downtown got one baby got one baby all right let's get someone good I say it is. I saw it in there too. I think it's Gronk. I'm gonna say I think it's I think it's Tom Brady. Tom Brady. Oh my God. Okay, what the purple shock is? Jacory and Bennett for the Raiders. Did you get one? Jaden Reed rookie. You didn't get one. Charlie sleeping. And it is Patrick Mahomes. Baby. Woo! Hell yes. Who got the Chiefs? Vern. Oh my God, Vern. Wow! Oh. Sorry for killing the mic, but that is Sorry. that That's is huge. that is huge, that. man. That is huge. Vernicle. Charlie ain't sleeping no more. This is the Patrick Mahomes Super Bowl downtown, and I have this at one thousand three hundred and fifty dollars based on the last two sales of this card. This card features an Arizona theme, as that is where last year's Super Bowl was held. But honestly, this should have been Brock Purdy, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. And our final honorable mention comes from Moonlit Rips, who breaks here on YouTube, and he was opening 2023 Select Basketball, and this was a mega box. Oh, this is a concourse. This is a concourse elephant, which means... All right, let's just see. It's a rookie. One, two, three, bam! We did it again. We freaking did it again. Oh my God. This is the Victor Wembenyama Rookie Concourse Elephant Prism, and I have this at $1,400 based on the last two sales of this card, which are now over two weeks old. I am guessing that the next sale will be a little bit less, but still a massive card, especially from retail. Can you believe that we are at $1,400 and we haven't even entered the top 10 yet? In April, this card would have landed at number 5. Retail was absolute mayhem in the month of May. Kicking us off at number 10 this month is Matt, who has a channel here on YouTube, and he was opening 2023-24 Select Basketball. This was a mega box, and the card's going to get spoiled right away at the beginning, but if I didn't show the beginning, you guys would be very confused at his reaction, so check this out. Just go out and win it. Sometimes it's Donovan. Oh my gosh. We got we pulled a Luca one of one. What? What? Oh, that's my first one of one pull. What? Unreal. Un unbelievable. It's a Luca one of one. Oh my gosh. Luca is that guy, speaking of like amazing clutch players this is my first one of one poll and it's out of the new select how about this for your first ever one of one this is the luka Doncic concourse black white gold prism one of one and i have this at about one thousand five hundred dollars and if you were interested in purchasing this card well I am sorry, as it just sold on Thursday night for just over $1,500 at eBay auction. This was a pretty good time for the auction to end as well, because Luca just dismantled the Wolves in Game 5 of the Western Conference Finals game. What a time to pull this. At number 9, we are with Mint Memorabilia, who break over on TikTok, and they were opening 2023 Donner's Optic Football, and this was a blaster box. We done did it! Blaster this morning. Woo! Oh my 
This is the CJ Stroud Rookie Optic Downtown, and I have this at $2,500. Based on the most recent sales of this card, this poll occurred back on May 3rd, however, and I believe these guys were the first to pull any downtown from this year's Optic, and it just so happened to be a Stroud. Congratulations to Sports Card Boulevard over on Facebook and Bubba Rips on Whatnot for also accomplishing this feat. At number eight, we are with Dirty Water Sports Cards, and over on their TikTok page, they posted this personal rip of 2023-24 Select Basketball, and this was a hanger box. Grab this from Walmart today. 23-24 NBA, 20 bucks. Let's see what's in it. Holy f Holy f Oh my god! Holy s Holy s Holy s Holy s Holy s I'm skipping right to it! Oh my f god! I think he was a little excited, and rightfully so. This is the Victor Wembanyama Rookie Lodestar Gold number 5 out of 10, and I have this at $2,500 as well. But unfortunately, there aren't any super short print sales of this insert for Wemby, but using these two certified insert sales and comparing the out of 99 sales of these two inserts, the Lodestar should sell for a little bit less. Not too shabby for a hanger box, but would you guys have opened that pack after seeing that it was on the back? I think I would have. At number seven, we have a poll from my buddy Jeff from Wisconsin who submitted this poll from 2024 Bowman Baseball. This was a blaster box and it looks like I need to get myself a little Yoda figurine. Check this out. Something, something there. Jeff was absolutely speechless. This is the Dylan Cruz First Paper Prospects Platinum 1 of 1, and I have this also at $2,500 based on what the orange out of 25 sales have been on this card, which are his current lowest numbered paper sales so far. Cruz was drafted second overall in 2023 and is currently number seven on the 2024 prospect rankings list. It's pretty cool knowing you had a chance at one of his one of one first Bowman cards in a retail box, and I assume the paper auto could be in one too. At number six, we're with Everything Collectibles, who on his YouTube channel posted this poll from 2023-24 Prism Monopoly Basketball. This was a blaster box. This video is going to be long. But I don't care how long. It... Ooh, is that gold? Is that a gold? Holy crap! Benedict Matherin, Bradley Beal. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. You've got to be sh right now. No. No. No, 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 yes. This is the Victor Wembanyama Rookie Gold Wave Millionaire, number three out of 10. And I have this at $3,000, which is the lower of the last two sales of this card, which were two months ago now. But Card Ladder estimates that the value has held, so I will assume the same. This card was literally pulled yesterday during a 500 subscriber celebratory rip. And needless to say, this card made it extra special. At number five, we are with Alarm Clock Rips and Gaming, and on his TikTok, he posted this personal rip of 2023-24 Select Basketball. This was a mega box. Okay, we got Spurs. Can I say Spurs, please? Rookie card. Oh, 
Victor Wembenyama. Oh wow. Number Premier two of ten. Wow. This is the Victor Wembenyama Rookie Premier Gold Cracked Ice, number 2 out of 10, and I have this at an estimated $3,500, which is a guess based on his highest Premier sales so far. I also have a more calculated approach to how I got there, but I don't want to spoil any of the future polls still to come. I am told this card was sent to PSA to be graded prior to being sold, so good luck with that. At number 4, we are back with Moonlit Rips, who had another massive pull from 2023-24 Select Basketball, and this was a mega box. We've got an elephant. We have got an elephant back here. Let's see? And it is not a rookie. No, it is. Holy sh... Um... Okay. <laughs> uh, we have a elephant, Victor Wembanyama. That is insane. And we... <laughs> okay, this is crazy. We have a Jalen Williams gold in the back out of 10. It's a number 9 out of 10. And we have a Victor Wembanyama. And they did it again. Well, this one came before the last one, but this is a Victor Wembanyama rookie mezzanine elephant prism. I have this at $3,850 based on what one of these sold for a couple of days ago at eBay auction. And if just pulling two Wemby elephants wasn't enough, they sent this card to PSA and it was returned as a PSA 10. That is now a potentially five figure card pulled from a retail box. Let's just say retail was good to Moonlit Rips in May. At number three, we are with Mini Rips who break over on Whatnot, and they were opening 2024 Bowman Baseball, and this was a blaster box. Swan Soto, Owen White rookie, up. Oh. Arjun Namala. Arjun Namala, one of one! One of one on the Bowman first for Arjun Namala! Oh my God, Blue Jays! This is the Arjun Namala First Prospect Paper Auto Platinum 1 of 1, and I have this at an estimated $4,500, which is three times more than what his Red Paper Auto out of 5 sold for last weekend. But this card is currently at eBay auction and is set to end this coming Wednesday. Namala is an 18-year-old who is currently the number three prospect in the Blue Jays organization. He was drafted 20th overall in 2023 and is the first first generation Indian American drafted in the first round of any of the four major U.S. sports. That is pretty cool. At number two, we are with Z Real, and on his YouTube channel, he posted this rip from 2023-24 Prism Basketball. This was a retail box, and as you can see here, he also has a whatnot in Instagram. His handle's right there for you, but check out this poll. All right, here's this next one right here. Come on, Wimby. Spurs. 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 <gasps> Spurs. Oh, my gosh. Please be the rookie. <gasps> Yo, you got to be kidding me right now! Ah! Woo! Woo! Give me my money, baby! Give me my money out of 42! I'm done ripping prism for this year basketball. Holy sh! Sorry for the cursing. Please subscribe, follow, like, share. Share, baby. And uh, if sports cards, hit, hit, uh, check your boy out. Shout him, shout him out, and uh, check check this, check this, check this out. I appreciate the shout out, my man. This is the Victor Wembanyama rookie pink pulsar number twenty two out of forty two, and I have this at five thousand two hundred dollars, which is in line with what this PSA nine is listed for as a best offer on eBay, and that is less than the one and only sale of one of these, which occurred a couple of weeks ago. These are exclusive to the twenty four pack retail boxes, and this pull comes with an interesting story. This guy and his dad, who is the one who got him into the hobby, ran into a Barnes and Noble after getting their hair cut and saw that they had an open retail box of Prism Basketball with about half of the packs left. The thing is, they were unable to make a purchase at that time because the electricity was out due to a storm. 
they were told they need to come back once the power was on in order to check out. I don't know if the box was held or how long it took for the power to come back on, but they were eventually able to make the purchase of the remainder of the box. And that night around midnight, this card came out of the very first pack they opened. This is such a big card, and I will be willing to bet that another will be on June's top 10 list, possibly landing at the number one spot. But not this month. We have one even bigger than this to round out this insane month of retail pulls. Let's see who and what took down the top spot in this month's top 10 retail sports card polls of the month. And taking down the number one spot this month is Archer, who breaks over on whatnot, and he was opening 2023-24 Select Basketball, and this was a blaster box. Lillard. Oh, we got a, we got a Christmas. We got a. Uh, okay, here we go. Is it a gold out of ten, or is it a? Uh, we'll see, man. We'll see. We'll see. We, we, we'll see. I don't want to hype it up. I just see gold. That's all I see. Okay. Here we go, baby. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let me gold, please. Let me gold, please. Let me gold, please. Oh my gosh. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Good luck. Oh! oh! The biggest card we've ever pulled! Oh my! First off to print. I'm shaking, dude. This is the Victor Wembenyama Rookie Mezzanine Gold Flash numbered 1 out of 10 and I have this at an estimated $7,000 based on the two gold mezzanine sales of this card which were both gold cracked ices. I would assume the cracked ices would be preferred over the flash but I don't have any evidence to support this. Regardless, given this is Wemby's jersey number, it will command quite the premium. I am told this card was overnighted to PWCC and is going to be sold there in raw condition, so keep your eyes out if you are a buyer. Congratulations to Archer on pulling the biggest card out of a retail box this month, which was not easy to do, and congratulations to the person who hit this card in his break. Now, good luck selling it. Congratulations to everyone who even made this list. That was incredible. Many of these polls are people's biggest polls they've ever had. So I'm very fortunate to have the help I have out there. Thank you to everyone who submitted polls for this show. If you ever see a big card pulled, at the very least, please shout out this show. Allow that person who pulled it a chance to submit their form to get on this episode and get featured. I want to give a huge thank you as well to PSA for your continued support of this series. Be sure to take advantage of those special because time does seem to pass very fast so you don't want to miss out thank you to the if fam for your support via the membership program here on youtube you guys are absolutely amazing and thank you guys for tuning in each and every week we do have a top 10 dropping on monday which is going to be most likely all hobby polls but i can tell you there are going to be some big cards on that list be sure to check that out make sure you have your notification bell clicked so you don't miss any of these videos because I dropped this one kind of on an off day, a Saturday. So hopefully you guys have a great weekend. Thank you so much for tuning in. And we will see you guys on the next one. Until then, be smart, be safe, and be humble. Ian out.